this is part of my video on water. In the bottles that you see there, I have my, the blue bottle has my new moon water, the purple has my full moon water, and the greenish bottle back there has, um, that is like my holy water that I make myself blessings over salt water basically and because i am a girl that loves water and i love the ocean and i can't always get to it um me and my coven may members made this mermaid water where we put rocks and seashells and stuff like that in water and put it in a jar and it just when i can't get to the ocean it just is a nice reminder <laughs> Of the ocean. Another element I use water in is in um, this the sprays that I use. Sometimes I just use the water element. Like this has rose um, rose oil and lavender oil in water. It smells divine, and I use it to spray and kind of fill the room with a good scent to kind of cleanse and. Um, have a higher vibration in my room. Moon water and new, new moon water I use for growth. So I use the, my new moon water a lot of times in my plants and it does help them grow. And I just, um, I say a prayer over my plants and I speak an intention and sometimes I bury it in the water. And it just kind of helps not only my plants grow, but situations and when I'm trying to increase on abundance, that happens. And then of course, with the full moon and full moon water, I use it for spiritual baths. Of course, my intention is set in here. Sometimes I use it for cleansing. I use that also in the spray that you see. I have that spray is with full moon water and the oils. And holy water I use when I'm doing rituals to kind of cleanse the area and sometimes to cleanse myself. So water is a very important element in my practice. Um, I use it a lot. And then we think of the water element. I associate the water element with um, emotional uh, and our emotions. So, you know, I kind of use water sometimes, even in a bath, in a shower. I get so many new ideas and everything in the shower. And I think it's because of the water element. So, like I said, water is very important in my practice. I think this is day four of the Neo Pagan Challenge started by Sunshine State, which, which I really want to give her a shout out and a thank you because I have met some great people. I think you have really brought the community together and it has been so much fun. Once again, water, the element of water, it cleanses, it settles, but water can also be uh, a catalyst for change. The water element, love it. Bye-bye.